Hello viewers, welcome to Engineering Study Materials. Today we are going to discuss about the vacuum bagging process. So what is vacuum bagging? Vacuum bagging is a clamping method which uses the atmospheric pressure to hold the resin or the resin coated components to, to hold rigid properly for the curing process. So let's get into this video. This is a basic diagram used for the vacuum bagging. It consists of a tool laminate. The laminate is placed in the radius film so that it can be taken easily after it is processed. The vacuum bagging technique is a perfect method for the uh, curing process of the composite materials because it is done under the atmospheric pressure so that it can be uh, properly sealed so that we can get the final component as a perfect structure it consists of the uh, parts such as pressure sensitive tape for the sealing purpose vacuum wall for the suction of the air inside the uh, film bagging film and uh, there are so much of components it can be used to improve the quality of the composites produced by the wet layup method. This is also a diagram consisting of a laminate placed on the release film and a bagging film is placed to cover this laminate and a vacuum pump is used to take the uh, air inside the bagging film so that the resin inside or the excess resin uh, placed on the laminate can be taken away in the trap and a gate valve or pump is also used then this is also a next next procedure it consists of a mold then laminate plates or piles are placed then breather release film bagging film are placed then vacuum pump is connected with the hose so that the air can be sucked out finally the resin excess resin can be taken away in a trap then the magging materials are the release fabric perforated film breather material vacuum bag mastic sealant plumbing system and mold release so let's get, get discussed about these parts release fabric it is a smooth woven fabric used to separate breather and laminate any excess epoxy can can be sucked through this release fabric then perforated film this film helps to hold the resin in laminate when high vacuum pressure is used with slow curing resin system or thin laminates then vacuum bag molding is used for the limited production runs because it is it consists it requires the vacuum so that it is not a uh, quick process so the production rate is also very slow but the quality of the product obtained is of very high then release film nylon or polyester film is used in the mold then bleeder bleeder materials absorb the excess resin from the layup while the resin cures the amount of the bleeder material is governed based on its absorbency that is how much the resin it can absorb from the laminate or a composite product then the fiber volume desired and the resin content of the laminate because fiber volume and resin content uh, determines the quality and strength of the product if the reinforcement or the fiber is more it it, uh, it is uh, more has uh, more high strength than uh, re re less fiber or reinforcement uh, product and if the resin compound is more it is of uh, it has a great toughness otherwise it will become a brittle material then the degree of resin cure the degree of resin cure can also be a major factor in this type of uh, process because the, res the resin curing time determines its quality if the resin is cured uh, quickly 
some cracks are tend to appear in the composite part if the resin cures slowly the the resin curing or a quality of the final product is uniform then barrier film it is a non stick film it is placed after the bleeder so that the resin flow can be controlled then breather film used to allow uniform application of the vacuum then vacuum bag it is used to contain the vacuum it is the important part which is used to, to hold the vacuum inside it that is generated by the pump and applied on the lap it must be resistant to the curing temperature and pressures applied on it it should be non porous since because if it is porous that it's not be a vacuum bag then mastic sealant yes sealant takes part a major role because if the sealant is of not uh, not in prop proper way the air escapes from it it provides a continuous airtight sealant between the bag and the mold also used to seal the point where the manifold enters the bag and to repair the leaks then the plumbing system consists of a vacuum hose vacuum port and control valve then trap the storage for the excess resin and the vacuum gauge for checking the vacuum pressure this is the vacuum bag molding process a product is prepared so what are the advantages high fiber volume fractions and lower void contents better fiber wet out due to pressure or resin flow heavier fabrics can be wet out and improved mechanical properties disadvantages are high labor skills for bagging the stage and joining bagging film for the large items costs for the consumers and equipment are very high the vacuum pump may strip wire volatiles from resin and consumer material compatibility with resin because the consumer material must be compatible if we place the uh, polystyrene with the uh, some other metal that is not uh, uh, applicable or compatible with the consumer means it's not a good product and the process doing is also a waste so right material will be chosen and right consumables and right resin should be mixed to get the correct product and consolidation pressure is limited to one atmosphere and applications are used used for manufacture of the nose cones radoms and uh, the process also used for making circuit breaker tubes applications are wide range of applications in the marine transport aerospace industrial energy infrastructure military etc this is the board prepared from this ceramic matrix or polymer matrix composite then this ocean transport vehicle can also be used or prepared from this polymer matrix composite then automobile bodies and vehicle bodies that is the quality monster 696 parts made most of the parts are a uh, composite material produced by this process from the polymer matrix composite so this is a short video friends if you like this video please hit a thumbs up button and share this video to your friends to gain knowledge and please subscribe this channel for more videos so thank you for watching